Hey, what's up my friends? We have a little bit of Espadia Daga today. So, make sure to grab a training bolo, grab a training knife. If you don't have a training bolo, grab a stick or a short stick. Doesn't really matter. Something long, something short. Got a quick, cool little Espadia Daga combo I think you're gonna like. Grab our gear, hit the thumbs up button, and let's get to the training. For today's drill, let's take a look at it. It's a nine count drill, that's what we're gonna be working. We're working off of this backhand position just like this. I'm gonna strike my backhand. Then I'm gonna come over the top with a Daga thrust. I'm gonna strike to the midline with the Espada and then strike low with the thrust of the Daga. I'm gonna circle this out, I'm gonna thrust through, strike this, pop another thrust, and then a powerful number one slash just like that. Got it? All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Let's go ahead and break it down one more time. And from the backhand position, I'm gonna strike that backhand. This could be a, di a diagonal or a horizontal, whatever you want. Thrust high line, hit the low line with the espada, and then thrust the low line right there with the daga. Circle this cutout, thrust through with the daga, slash that angle two again with the espada, and then thrust or a quick jab with the daga, and then a powerful number one cut just like that. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine strikes total. I told you, I told you, all right? I'm telling you the truth. Let's go ahead and just kind of work out a little bit, move around, have some fun with this combination. And if you make a mistake, no big deal. Just take a mental note and try again better on the next repetition. Let's work it out a little bit. Start slow, okay? Start nice and slow, and then you can always gradually pick it up. Oh, I made a mistake. No big deal. This is why you're training. Slow it down if you have to. Okay? Get that coordination back dialed in. And then just work it out. You don't need to be getting all crazy frustrated over drills like this. Okay? These are just drills to start working some coordination and start to develop and understand the flow of the weapons. Have some fun. Gotta keep the fun in the training, my friends. Keep the fun in the training. Whoa. All right, there you got it, super simple drill. If you need this one broken down, if you need me to slow down this drill for you and really break it down step by step, click the join button right below this video and become a channel member. That's where I'm putting in all the best training this entire year here on the YouTube channel. All in our members area on the YouTube channel. It's $1.99 to join, guys. That's it. The more people we get to join in the members, then I can start taking some ads off of our videos. Plus, I'm switching over a whole bunch of my, my past videos here on YouTube. I'm switching them over to our members area. So you're gonna have to be a member to watch that. And I've already switched like 200 videos over to our, our members, and I'm still working on that. So by the time it's all said and done, I'll have more videos only in our members area than that's publicly viewable. So get on over there, get on in there, click the join button right below this video, $1.99, that's all it takes. Uh, it helps to support me, support the channel. It's not easy making these videos, guys. Like I got two broken tripods I'm gonna have to replace this year, okay? It, it happens, cameras get broken sometimes and Things happen, especially when I'm going out to those crazy environments and it's really windy. Things get knocked over and they break. And uh, it gets expensive to make these videos to keep this channel going. So it really helps me out when you guys pitch in just that little tiny extra for me. It really does help me out. So I got another video of this exact drill broken down, slowed down for my members. I'll see you on the inside in about a minute. Wham!